What's cooking today? Two hours for you every day on CRN. Hour number one with Jack Roberts and Eric Hines. Hour two with Paul Stern and yours truly, Michael Horn. Food, wine, travel, entertainment, celebrity news for you all right here on the uh, What's Cooking program. Now, Paul Stern, we're headed off now to uh, Wolfie's Huff and Puff Mini Mart. It's in New Lexington, Ohio. Mike Kane, the owner, is with us, and apparently some kind of a lottery situation yesterday. Mike Kane, are you there? Yes, sir. Hey, welcome to the broadcast. Thank you. How are you guys today? We're great. Where is Wolfie's Huff and Puff Mini Mart located in New Lexington, Ohio? Uh, we're located right on North Main Street, right in the middle of New Lexington. And New Lexington, of course, located down in uh, southeastern Ohio. Just South- to narrow it down a little bit for you. Are you a Cincinnati Reds fan? Cincinnati Reds, Cleveland Indians. Gotcha. Anything in Ohio. <laughs> Anything in Ohio. We gotcha. Okay, so let's get to it. What happened? Now, this happened yesterday, is that correct? No, it was actually last Tuesday. Last uh, Tuesday. Yes. Uh, right. the, uh, for the uh, Mega Millions drawing. So it's a Mega, a Mega Millions lottery drawing. So what happened? Tell us the story. Well, as everybody knows, Mega Millions is a multi-state uh, lottery. And, uh, uh, of course, Ohio uh, joined that a few years ago. And last Tuesday evening, about 6.30, uh, PM our time here, uh, the lady that was working at our store, Naomi Mahler, uh, got a customer in here that wanted to play his Mega Millions tickets, and when she ran his tickets, she didn't include uh, a game that's just unique to Ohio and uh, Mega Millions. It's called the Kicker. Uh, it's just a game, uh, an extra dollar, and uh, it's five extra numbers you get to win a chance to win some more money. Well, she didn't include the kicker on his Mega Millions ticket, and the gentleman, uh, being the nice guy that he is, he just simply explained to her that he did want the kicker, and so she replayed his numbers, included the kicker, but she went ahead and bought her $2 mistake uh, because Mega Millions tickets can't be canceled. Uh, So she took the $2 out of her pocket, and she bought the mistake, uh, the ticket that said no to the kicker, and that's how we got two winners. Uh, each ticket, uh, uh, five of these six numbers come in that night, and each uh, person, Naomi, and another gentleman from here in New Lexington. Okay. Uh, 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 let me see if I got this straight now. Hold on. A so, <laughs> so you buy these lottery numbers, and you got a chance if you pay a buck more, you get a, an extra number, extra set of five numbers or whatever, correct? Yeah, yes. Okay, so this guy bought his ticket, but... He he said he wanted the kicker, but she didn't hear him, or whatever happened, she didn't give him the kicker, right? That's correct. So she used her own money to buy the kicker, and she bought two more tickets, is that correct? No, she just bought the ticket that she ran for him that didn't include the kicker. Okay, so she bought the ticket back from him, right? Yes, yeah, she just basically bought it, so she's a... Uh a uh, real hard work and honest employee, and she, and she didn't want her drawer coming up short, so she exactly. took the $2, bought the mistake, as I call it, sure. and... Uh, gave him a new ticket, right? Gave him a new ticket. And he was okay ticket. with that. He was happy with that. He was happy So which that. ticket won, hers or his? They both, both of them. They both won. Each won $250,000. Wow. So even with the kicker, that didn't play any effect. In yeah, he didn't. Uh, he didn't hit the kicker that night. He just what? got the. Uh, just got the. So he picked game. the numbers that actually won the the, the, the jackpot. Yes, he uh, he told wow. me that they're a uh, the first five numbers. Uh, they're birthdays of his. Uh, I believe his wife and his children and uh, his probably wow. and. Uh, he plays these numbers every Tuesday and Friday night. He's played them for years, and he always plays them here at Wolf's Huff and Puff. So uh, that night uh, was very lucky for him and uh, our employee, Naomi, uh, who wow. took $2 so, out of her pocket. And so, he's not upset that he's got a share of this, even he, though they were his numbers, right? He's not upset at all. In fact, he was in the store Friday. He had just uh, confirmed his ticket with Ohio Lottery. Uh, he took a couple extra days, and he actually come in that store, and we had a little reunion with him and uh, Naomi. And uh, wow, uh, yeah, it was a uh, it was a very it was a great day, and it's a great story. She uh, uh, is deserving of this. Uh, she really needs it. Wow. Uh, well, here's the deal. We just talked about the show, and you probably didn't hear this. We're talking to Mike Kane, the owner of Wolfie's Huff and Puff Mini Mart in New Lexington, Ohio, where now two lottery tickets, the winners came up. If you think about other people, think good things happen to you. Here is uh, Naomi was thinking about doing the right thing. She could have just pocketed. She could have had her cash drawer. She could have screwed you guys over at the Wolfie's <laughs> Huff and Puff Mini Mart, but right. she wanted to do it the right way. She thought about you. She thought about what was the honest way to go, and then 
and she wins the lottery along with this guy. I like the story. It's a great story, and uh, they're both uh, very good people. And, and, of course, here in New Lexington, it's just a small community. Uh, it's, uh, uh, it was really good to see somebody local, uh, you know, somebody from right here in, right here in the city, and uh, it's just yeah, been a it's great. just a great week. It's What's the great. guy's name? Has he announced his name yet? The winner? Uh, yes, it's Andy McMillan. All right. Well, congratulations to Andy and Naomi. Did you? Uh, does the store get a little something as well? What we get uh, through Ohio Lottery, we we get uh, a one thousand dollar bonus uh, for Ooh. each ticket. So congratulations! Uh, you got a couple thousand. They would Paul and I'll be in for a beer later today. I'm just stopping. Like I'm stop not thinking about ourselves. Mike Kane, you're a good man, and it sounds like you got Thanks. great people working for you. And there's always good people in Ohio too. Congratulations to you. There's Mike Kane, owner of Wolfie's Huff and Puff Mini Mart.